Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2 is divided into two parts, where both the parts will cover one arc each, whereas the first part is going to cover Hidden Inventory Arc or Premature Death Arc, and the second part will cover Shibuya Incident Arc, and the Hidden Inventory Arc consists of just five episodes and it's nearly coming to end, so it has been a really good arc but also confusing at times, where you might feel lost at times, especially about Master Tingen and the Star Plasma Vessel, and it's completely normal because the storytelling is very fast-paced, so to keep up with it is very difficult, but don't worry, after watching this video you'll understand everything about Master Tingen and the Star Plasma Vessel, so let's begin. Master Tingen, before we learn about the Star Plasma Vessel, you must know about Master Tingen and their role in the Jujutsu society. So, Master Tingen is a Jujutsu sorcerer, Tingen's current form, or gender, is unknown but used to be that of a female human in the past. Now, what's so special about this character? Well, it is their innate Jujutsu technique, which is immortality, this enabled them to live on eternally, but there is one problem that comes with it, which is connected with the Star Plasma Vessel. While immortality might sound like a blessing, it is referred to as a curse in the manga, because there will come a time when Master Tingen's technique will force a process known as evolution or simply aging. This process basically transforms their body as well as eliminates their will and self-consciousness. As a result, Tingen becomes a cursed spirit from a human and poses a larger threat to the whole world. This is because Tingen is the reason a balance exists between the Jujutsu world by strengthening the barriers surrounding all the Jujutsu high sites, so, you can now understand why this character is vital in maintaining the balance, and without them, this Jujutsu society will collapse. Coming back to Tingen's connection with the Star Plasma Vessel, Tingen needs to merge with another human, who is the Star Plasma Vessel, to stop the evolution process, this merging will basically put an end to that process, and this needs to happen once every 500 years to reinvigorate Tingen's immortality by rewriting their body's genetic information. Star Plasma Vessel, so by now, you must have understood Tingen and the need for a Star Plasma Vessel, it's time to take a look at the Star Plasma Vessel in a detailed manner, the Star Plasma Vessels are born every time in the time of need around the Jiu-Jitsu world, the Star Plasma Vessels are young females who are compatible to be merged with Master Tingen, thus, putting an end to their aging process, now, multiple Star Plasma Vessels can be born at the same time, but there is a catch, the catch is that every Star Plasma has a certain potential, and the one with the highest potential is selected for the merger. It is even said that once the vessels are merged with the Jujutsu user, they have the ability to make contact with the previous vessels that merged with the user. The star plasma vessel shown in Jujutsu case in Season 2 is Riko Aminai, will she merge with Tingen or not? You will definitely get an answer to that question in the anime soon. Importance of star plasma vessel in Jujutsu Kaisen The importance of this merging process can be understood by knowing more about Tingen, Tingen is the sole reason for the balance of power in the Jujutsu world, they have reinforced the world with many barriers, without him, the balance and the security will entirely collapse, and if this happens, it would be more dangerous for the Jujutsu sorcerers to go on missions, but the worst of all is if no one quells the evolution process, Tingen Sama may become the enemy of humankind, which they swore to destroy. The process of merging is indeed a sad process of altruism, but as Thanos once said, you have to pay a small price for salvation. So, the Star Plasma Vessel needs to be merged and Tingen's curse technique has to be reset every 500 years in the Jujutsu Kaisen universe, therefore, this sacrifice is very much necessary for protecting the balance of the world. So everyone, this was the complete explanation about Master Tingen and the Star Plasma Vessel, hope you've understood it completely, as of now I'll meet you in my next video with another interesting topic, till then goodbye.